Kate Middleton is friends and equals with the Queen, but Meghan is not, expert reveals. Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton, 36, have both married into the British royal family. Meghan attended an official trip with the Queen less than a month after her wedding to Prince Harry. What did her body language reveal compared to Kate? Meghan Markle and the Queen have appeared together again tonight at the second event in one month. The two built on their seemingly close bond at the event this evening. Meghan and the monarch attended the Queen's Young Leaders program at Buckingham Palace. Meghan's relationship with the Queen has gone from strength to strength as she attended the reception for the first time. Earlier this month Meghan Markle and the Queen, 92 looked very close on their trip to Cheshire. The pair sat close together and giggled on Meghan's first trip with the Queen just a month after her wedding. Kate Middleton's first trip out with the Queen came almost a year after her wedding to Prince William. Though the different treatment could be seen as a snub for Kate, a body language expert reveals it may have given the Duchess of Cambridge the upper hand. Body language expert Judy James said, Kate has always been a duck to water in terms of her royal body language displays, and the fact that she had known William for years and had more access to role models for her new role emerged strongly in her nonverbal behavior with the Queen. In an image of the monarch and Kate walking in St. Pancras station of their first trip out in 2012, Judy claims the Duchess pulled off a tricky situation. She said, she managed to pull off the challenging trick of walking slightly behind the monarch but without looking diminished or uncomfortable and this was probably down to her time spent doing the same with William before their engagement. Her ability to do this allowed her to manage her communications with the Queen to the point where the two women look like friends and almost equals. Meghan, on the other hand, looks less relaxed and lower status next to the Queen. Judy said, the body language expert told Express Co. UK, Meghan was thrown into the deep end when she married Harry with little or no royal experience, and although she is clearly putting in an industrial strength effort to develop her royal poise and body language the fact she is having to learn on the job seems to have created a very different balance between her and the Queen. The shared laughter and affection signals look very similar to Kate's poses but Meghan is currently looking more like a granddaughter-in-law than female friend. At some moments she uses some pseudo-infantile re-motivational techniques to look cute and slightly vulnerable but at others her smile looks more nurturing as she listens to a woman who is nearly three times her own age. Kate and the Queen appear totally in tune with one another, Judy said. A picture of the pair sharing a laugh reveals just how relaxed the two are as the Queen lets her fun side show. Judy said. This is a very unusual glimpse of the Queen's humorous side as she performs a comedy pose to entertain Kate. With her arms held aloft and pulling a funny face the Queen gets a totally complimentary response here in terms of a genuine, nose-wrinkled and open-mouthed laugh from Kate. The two women look totally in tune here, so much so that the Queen is getting nonverbal encouragement to show even more of her fun side. Meghan on the other hand shows that she is keen to make a good impression, Judy said. Meghan's pose here is pseudo-infantile, suggesting a desire to look young and quite cute in a bid to make a complimentary and favorable impression on the Queen. While Kate's signals were more woman-to-woman -woman with the Queen, including the addition of some subtle protocol-induced status-lowering rituals, Meghan looks more like a favorite grandchild here, perhaps looking for approval and advice rather than offering support in two-way conversation. Judy James recently analyzed Meghan Markle at Ascot. The Duchess of Sussex had her first royal race day, and she was tasked with handing out a trophy with her husband. What does a body language expert have to say about Meghan's transformation from L.A. actress to British Duchess at Ascot? Judy James told Express Co. UK. There are three clear body language signals that the training she has had is paying off. How has Meghan perfected her royal transformation? Judy looked at subtle changes to Meghan's body language since she joined the royal family. 